Hey friends, this is Atif Opier. Well, and welcome to the new update on GFT token. In today's video, I would like to show you this big falling wedge pattern that GFT token has formed on the daily time frame chart. And breaking out the resistance of this falling wedge pattern will be the key for a price reversal, a massive price reversal of GFT. And on the short term, we will also take a look at this symmetrical triangle as well. But before starting this analysis, if you are not subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe it. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member, because here I'm sharing different trading signals for you on the daily basis. And you can find a link to join me here in the video's description I've shared. And if you would like to see how my trading signals work, then you can also watch my previous uh, trading signals report. Like I've shared uh, the link for the previous month's trading signal report in the video's description. You can find that link. And when you will open that link, uh, there are all links for my trading signals are shared. And for example, this is the trading signal for NMR token. You just need to click on the link and uh, it will take you to the trading views chart. And there is a play button available, by the way, on every chart. And you just need to click this play button and it will show you how the price had moved up from the buying zone and rallied to the sell target zone. Now, let me take you here on the daily time frame chart. And here we can see that uh, GFT has formed a very big falling wedge pattern on the daily time frame chart. It started the formation back on 8th of Feb 2023, and so far it is not able to break out the resistance of this falling wedge pattern. But uh, we can see that the movement of the price line is getting squeezed inside this falling wedge pattern. Therefore, soon we can expect that it can break this pattern. And this is, by the way, a bullish bias pattern. Therefore, there is a very high probability that finally the price line will break out the resistance of this falling wedge. However, if uh, the price line breaks down the support of this falling wedge pattern, uh, then the target to the downside can be here. That will be approximately at uh, 2.9 cents. And I will also share the target for the breakout with you as well. But before that, I would like to share uh, this triangle with you that uh, GFT has formed on the four hour time frame chart. And this is the symmetrical triangle. And this can be a very, very decisive pattern for a GFT. If the price line breaks out this resistance, that can be a very a lead to a very, very big breakthrough. Because after the breakout, uh, let me first show you the target for the breakdown. If we will uh, break down the support of this triangle, in that case, the price line can move down here approximately at 4.4 cents and in case of breaking out this triangle the move to the outside can be approximately at 7.8 cents or 8 cents now if we move back here then you can see already gft is moving very close to the resistance of this very big falling wedge pattern and the resistance this time is approximately at 6.1 cents if, and if the price then breaks out this smaller triangle then it can reach here to hit the target for this breakout in that situation, the price line can also break out this very, very big resistance of the falling wedge pattern. And once GFT will be able to break out this falling wedge pattern, that will be the best time to buy GFT. And for example, if we consider that it is about to break out this wedge, then in that situation, we can set our stop loss below the recent swing low before the breakout. In this situation, if the price line breaks out this wedge, we have the recent swing low here that is at 5.3 cents. That is the recent swing low so far. And uh, once the price line will break out, then after breaking out, once we will buy a, buy GFT, then we can set our stop loss below then this level. And the target to the upside will be here at the top of the wedge. That will be approximately from 16 cents to 18 cents. So this was the update so far. I hope that you have liked the analysis. Then do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel as well. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member. Because here I am sharing different trading signals for you. And you can find a link to join me here in the video's description I've shared. Take care. Goodbye.